importance of CO2 in greenhouse growing. Plants use two main metabolic processes to create sugars, respiration and photosynthesis. During respiration, plants uptake oxygen and release carbon dioxide, CO2. During photosynthesis, plants utilize the sun, uptake water and CO2, in turn releasing oxygen. Through small cell pores called stomata, CO2 may enter plants when guard cells are open. Plants are always in need of either CO2 or oxygen to create energy and grow. It is important to monitor and control CO2 as different levels of CO2 do affect growth rate up to a significant margin. What is a proper CO2 level? Maintaining a level between 340-900 ppm is ideal. Here are some CO2 best practices. Younger plants utilize CO2 supplementation better than mature plants. Add CO2 2 hours after sunrise and stop 2 hours before sunset. Monitor levels and use set points for release. Distribute CO2 with horizontal fans above crops. Be prepared to fertilize more than usual. What are the advantages of CO2 supplementation? Increase plant growth and biomass accumulation up to 100% for C3 plants and 25% for C4. Decreased time to maturity for a faster crop turnaround. Higher CO2 may cause a reduction in transpiration, increasing water use efficiency. W-U-E